Milady. Oh, I didn't see you there, I'm sorry. Who are you exactly? Were you Tweedles? <laughs> My Tweedles? At your service. Lovely. What are your names? We don't have names, Milady. A servant is defined only by a service. Oh, um, shall we prepare the tea for her arrival? Who's arrived? Hello, Anastasia. Your Majesty. Welcome. Oh, tomorrow's your wedding day. You're to be queen of this castle. It's I who should defer to you. Uh, of course. really honored he accepted our invitation. And I was surprised to receive it. The Red King and I have never seen eye to eye on anything. I didn't know that. Well, men like him tend to find me... ...threatening. The King believes royal shouldn't have magic. This separates us from our subjects. Oh, I think a little separation's a welcome thing. We queens have so much to think about. Why not use everything at our disposal to help us rule? I guess I haven't thought of it in that way. <laughs> Perhaps you can help steer the Red King to my point of view. You remind me of myself. I had humble beginnings, too. I see your potential. My own daughter has been a disappointment to me. You're much more the kind of daughter I'd choose to have, if, <laughs> if one could choose such things. And should you choose to learn a touch of magic, I could teach you. And what the king doesn't know won't hurt him. I appreciate the offer, but I hardly think keeping secrets is the best way to begin a marriage. <laughs> but it's a wonderful way to begin a friendship. Perhaps another time. Thank you. Your Majesty. Oh, my door is always open.